He has not forgotten you. A Christian sister once said something like this to the devil. Satan, you've been too quiet for my liking. I've not received any threat from you for some time now. What are you planning in secret? Manifest in Jesus' name because I want to know what you are up to. Not long after that, what the devil was planning in secret concerning this sister's family was actually exposed. If you are a child of God, the devil hates you. And he hates you even more if you are serious with your Christianity. So he's always after you, looking for how to create problems for you and drag you either back into the world or into a situation where you are so preoccupied with the problems he has created that you cannot face the work that the king has committed into your hands. But then there are times when you are at peace. Everything is beautiful. Your marriage is the way you want it. Your children are doing very well. A lot of money is coming in from your job or business. No member of your household is ill. You are able to be committed to the work of the Lord and so on. At such a time, it is very easy to imagine that the devil has forgotten your name and where you live. But watch out. He still has you in mind. He has not forgotten you. He is making his plans in secret, hoping to come suddenly upon you. They say that the best time to prepare for war is the time of peace. This is also true in the warfare between us and the devil. The time you think that you have no problem, that is probably the time you should pray more because you don't know the angle from which the enemy wants to surprise you, whether it is in the area of health, marriage, your job, or your children. Psalm 91 verse, 5, verse 1 says that the one that dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. The way to dwell in the secret place of the Lord is to constantly maintain an attitude of worship to Him. Be prayerful, study the word of God, work for him, and fellowship with the brethren. If you are always in the presence of the Lord, even when things are beautiful for you, the devil cannot come upon you suddenly because the Lord will reveal things to you, including Satan's plans, and what to do before or when they do manifest. That way, you will always be ready for the devil. It is the one who stays away from the Lord when things are cool, that panics and runs helter skelter when they get heated up. Are things very beautiful for you now? Don't take that as a reason for you to relax. Satan has not forgotten you. May the Lord give us wisdom in Jesus' name.